Whoosh! Very well, welcome to Let's Long Play. V, 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 yeah, V six times, okay. This is a platform game that was released back in uh, 2011, I think, or 2012, no, 2000, 2010 or 2011, I don't know. But yeah, I played it recently, since it's very, very short, I decided to do a long play of some sort. I can, I am able to complete it in around an half an hour, a little bit more. Well, yeah, we'll just do a long play. It's a pretty fun game, actually. So, you know, well, you say. So, I need to go under the game options and clear all data. Yes, delete everything. So, you start right from zero. Alright. Let's start the game. Uh oh. Is everything okay? No, we've hit the Ninstar elevator defense. Something's wrong. We're going to crash. Evacuate. Oh no. Everyone off the ship. This shouldn't be happening. Phew. That was scary. At least we all escaped. Right, guys? Guys? Welcome aboard. Press arrow keys on WSD to move. You can only move left and right. Because what can you do is press action to flip. So if you press Z or up or down, this is what happens. You can basically walk on the floor. I mean, you can walk on the floor and you can walk on the ceiling if you press the Z or up and down button. So yeah, you can basically flip around like that. I wonder why the ship teleported me here alone. I hope everything else got out okay. This thing over here is a checkpoint. You touch it next time you die because you can. If you touch one of these spiky arrows or any other things actually, the moves. Many things here are your enemies. You can just farm the checkpoint. You both play traffic down. Okay, there's a checkpoint there. I should have taken it though. Come on. Okay, so for example, these things here are enemies if I die, but I don't want to. I get back at the checkpoint immediately. I'm starting filtering unit. Okay. So you could go right left here, but there's actually a secret if you go over here. It's a secret to nobody. And that old thing over there. Oh, come on. You gotta get it. There we go. We found a shiny trinket, one out of twenty. There are twenty of these things we gotta find through the game. And they're quite for 100%, of course. Linear Collider. Press Enter to activate terminal. Almost everyone has been evacuated from the space station now. The rest of us are leaving in a couple of days once our search is being completed. Okay, let's wait until these things get out of the way. Pretty easy for now. For now, it will become a lot harder later on. Secure this move. Gantry and Dolly. Now these platforms will actually disappear if you spend too much on them. I mean, once you stand on them, they'll disappear after a while. Help! Can anyone hear this message? Violet, is that you? Captain, you're okay. Something has gone horribly wrong with the ship's teleporter. I think everyone has been teleported away randomly. They could be anywhere. Oh no. I'm on the ship. It's damaged badly, but it's still intact. Where are you, Captain? I'm on some sort of space station. It seems pretty modern. There seems to be some sort of interference in this, na in this nation. I'm broadcasting the coordinates of the ship to you now. I can't teleport you back, but if you can find a teleporter anywhere nearby, you should be able to teleport back to me. Okay, I'll try to find one. Good luck, Captain. I keep trying to find the rest of the crew. Okay, so if you press enter, you can enter the menu, and there's the map option that shows you the map that you discovered so far. The crew that they have rescued, Viridian that's main, then there's Vermilion, Violet, Verdigris, and Vitellaria and Victoria, and are all missing, so we gotta find them. The statistic number of deaths zero thing that's found, I'm taken. And you can save the game. You can save whatever you want, basically, but... The game auto saves every now and then when you hit the teleporter. Well, we haven't seen the teleporter yet, but anyway. Let's keep moving on here. Okay. Platform, oh, there we go. Yes, man. Oh, easy roam. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Ah. Stop and reflect. Now, see, this game, you're not able to jump, so you need to go from platform to platform, you have to kind of leap. Similar to Doom, right? When you can't jump, you just have to leap. 
Oh, it's another one of those shiny things. We probably don't need it, but it might be nice to take it back to the ship to study. Okay, for well, this one is gonna look trickier, but you need to make... You do this from platform to platform to wait those little soldiers. Two out of twenty. Now you can just die and get back to the checkpoint left. But let's see if I can just not die. Whoop! There we go. But you now you go down here. You can actually take the other path. Easy. Percentage view view map a quick save. I told you that. But busted. Uh, sensible run. Boo! Think fast. Ah, oh, come on. There we go. Driller, now go down here, to the right, ah, oh, come on. Alright, whoop, whoop, whoop. If you're afraid you can push up and down instead of action to flip, yeah. Okay. Drop down the bottom, dump of mad carry you. Whoop, whoop. Brass send us on the top, uh oh. Go away, there you go. Done. A wrinkle in time, a teleporter! You can get back to the ship with this. Captain! Yeah, rescue the crew member. Poor man. So, Doctor, have you any idea what caused the crash? There's some sort of bizarre signal here that's interfering with our equipment. It caused the ship to lose its quantum position, collapsing us into this dimension. Oh no. But I think we should be able to fix the ship and get out of here. As long as we can find the rest of the crew. We really don't know anything about this place. Our friends could be anywhere. They could be lost or in danger. They, can they teleport back here? No, unless they find some way to communicate with us. We can't pick up their signaling. They can't teleport here unless they know where the ship is. So what So what do we do? We need to find them. Head on to the mansion and look for anywhere they might have ended up. Okay, where do we start? Well, I've been trying to find them with the ship scanners. It's not working, but I did find something. These points show up in our scans are having high energy patterns. There's a good chance they're teleporters, which means they're probably built near something important. It could be a very good place to start looking. Okay, I'll head out and see what I can find. You'll be right I'll be right here if you need any help. Sure you will. So you can talk to Violet here, this is the ship, so from now on the game is no more linear. You can do whatever levels you want, there are like four more levels you need to do. And you can explore the overworld, but you can do each of these four levels in your own order. There's not an order anymore. I feel a bit of a Doctor. Where do I begin? Remember you can press enter to check where you are on the map. Look for the areas where the rest of the crew might be. If you get lost, you can go back to the ship from any teleporter. And don't worry, we'll find everyone. Everything will be okay. Sure, let's check this computer in here. The DSS so high. Ship navigation control. Error, error. Cannot insulate dimensional coordinate. Interference detected. There's more down here. Cheap radio status broadcasting. They always say that, so... Now here is the jukebox. Songs will continue to fly until we leave the ship. Collect trinkets to collect new songs. Next unlock five trinkets, yeah, you, you can unlock the, you can find these trinkets, shiny trinkets. You gotta listen to the music of the game, well, uh, This seems like a good place to store some shiny trinkets. Victoria loves to study the interesting things we find in our adventures. I hope she's okay. Alright, to go down here, if you go to the left, there's this little portrait. You can teleport from a teleporter to others that you have discovered. I can only teleport here, of course. So, that's pretty pointless, unless I want to go back there. And this way, you just get out, and now you can explore. It's a really big overworld there. But, since we can, we, we drop immediately next to an area, I think we'll start to that area. So, go down here. There are a couple of spikes, but they're easy to avoid. Alright, then I go over here. Whoop! And there's a teleporter. So, for example, if I wanted to go back to the ship, you could just do that. And bang, I'm back to the ship. And if you want to go back there... Here I am. 
Alright, let's move on. Really quickly. I'm not gonna say all, I'm not gonna read all the textures down below. The name of the areas. I mean, they're cool and all, but... He's gonna get through this quickly. Get ready to bounce. Let's do this. Alright, those lines will actually flip you out whenever you touch them. So yeah, that's the mechanic of the area. There we go. Whoop, whoop. Whoop, terminal. Turns out the key to stabilizing this dimension, which will create a balance and force outside of it. So it looks like it's just a temporary solution at best. I've been working on something more permanent, but it seems it's going to be too late. Double slip experiment. Okay, there's something up here. Young man, it's worth the challenge indeed. Drink at time. Hup, hup, hup. 320. There we go. Ah, my bad. Oh, there we go. Easy. And, yeah. The apex. Alright. Ah, some big sour. Ah, I can't mess with me. No. Uh, is that gonna be bad? I knew it. You gotta keep. You just gotta hold right here, and that now here you can. Have to find your timing. Okay, checkpoint. Portal. There's not a trinket this way. In a terminal. Access to the control center is still possible through the main atmospheric filters. There's a name for where the next area is. On the next, there's not, there's not an order again, but we'll go there next. And 4 to 20. We'll find them all eventually. Some of those are also even in the overworld. But they're not that hard, uh, They're not that hard to actually find. I mean, they're you find. You can't. Some of them are, and we'll see them in the next area. There will be two more difficult, more difficult ones are in the next area. Okay, the granola principle. Wax? Well, not really. Part of 20. Point. Ah, come on. Whatever, I hate the second point. Alright. Uh. Huh? Kids, well, not now. Kids, the same bounce. Ah, come on. It's so easy. There we go. Alright, now we're in the middle of the area. Now, here, there's actually an even path for another trinket that took me forever to find out. Now, see, so you're supposed to go this way, but if you do this, you'll be on, on the silent here. And you can walk all the way to the right. We get to this weird room. Where does it drink it? 60 to 20, then you can just die. And be brought back here. Alright. Okay, the difficult, a difficult chore. This one's actually complicated. So there's spikes in the middle. Yeez. Wow, they didn't burst try. That was always a pain for me. Okay. Why so blue? Oh no, Captain! Are you stuck here too? It's okay, I'm here to rescue you. Let me explain everything. What? I didn't understand any of that. Oh, well, don't worry. Follow me, everything will be alright. Really? Okay then. Let's get out of here. You can rescue the crew member. Do you remain? I like that we're back to the ship. Now, the, the character who rescued Victoria, I think it was. Yeah, Victoria is here near the trinket. So you can talk with her. I'm so glad to be back. The lab was so dark and scary, I didn't like it at all. She had a few things to say to me. Yeah, Captain, I found this in that lab. I found the shiny trinket, so I don't know anything. Any idea what it does? Sorry, I don't know. It seems important though. 
Maybe something will happen if we find them all. Indeed, the world. Alright, let's move on. Now, our next area is supposed to be there on the long yellow square on the right. So, go there if I remember correctly. Need to travel through here to the bottom of the ship. And eventually, yeah, I'll be on the other side of the map, okay. And just keep going this way. And yeah, when you find this, these rocks over here, they look like arrows, you're pointing into a portal. Which is really important because it teleports you to this part of the map. Okay, then. Okay, I need to go over there and go. Huh? Yeah, there's an entrance here. For a reason. Okay, whoop, 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 whoop. And the terminal. The final step in creating the dimensional stabilizer was to create a feedback loop. Okay, pointing us, to, pointing us to the next area, thank you so much. We'll go there next. It's kind of a neat area, actually, so... Because it's pretty hard to find a way in. Outer Hall, let's do this. Alright. Stop with these conveyors, because they can speed you in that direction they're pointing at. Ah, come on. The yeah, road is low. It's because you need to... Whoop! Like that? And there we go. Drink it for you. In order 20. You wouldn't end up here if you want... If you use the other... The normal solution, you took the up road, I mean the up road. Yeah, the high road. You wouldn't end up here and then you can have just done this. Alright, so... Whoop! Of course that throat thing is actually hard to... There we go. Okay, select the track. You can go up and down, but you should go up definitely. You chose poorly. As you say. Okay. So now I drink it there, but we'll get it later. Links in from here on. Ah, come on. Okay, I need to do the right timing here. There we go. Whoop. Okay. Whoop! Done. Not that hard. Whoop. Okay, now this one's pretty complicated. But not really. I mean, at least in the beginning. And then you have to do that again. That's pretty complex. Okay. Now we need to avoid these yeah, these things. But the conveyor belt is now helping us because it's slowing us down. Come on, guys. Woo! Get out of the way. Thank you. Okay, checkpoint now here. This is, this is tricky. It sounds very edgy, you won't get hit by the spikes, but that's very hard. And that's very hard, I mean, it takes a, a little while. 920 trinkets, ah. Like that. Whoop. Okay, now it's way easier to avoid these things now that, that the conveyor belt is our, our favorite. Did you go? Whoop. Whoop. Aha! That trinkets for later. Solution to the illusion. Okay, easy, easy to avoid the clouds. Or very easy. Teleport. Green Grotto. Now you go up here and that circle, blue circle over there is actually... Is, is a bad. It will hurt you. Everything collapses eventually. It's the way of the universe. Okay. Sorry. Okay. Checkpoint. Don't go down yet. You can see some rooms from here. Now you can go down. Okay, if you want a trinket, go this way. There's a little bonus path. We need to get a trinket we saw before. Okay. Whoop! Got it. I can just backtrack like this. Good. And let me get a checkpoint, sorry. There we go. All lies the nap. Spikes do! Yeah. If you don't if you don't move yourself to to the right, you will get the you will fall the spikes. Whoop! Ah, oh, come on! There we go. Okay, good point. Whoop! Keep 
pull up? Just beat yourself down. Okay. This one's actually pretty complicate, com complicated. It's complex. You need to sleep a lot of times. Oops, the point. Time to take it from low. Okay. The wording. Okay, seeing dollar signs. Now this one can be a little complicated. What you gotta do where is this? Whoop. Okay. Good learning. Getting years old for fun. Now here's the most difficult trinket ever. What you gotta do is not this. You need to go down here. Are those all these spikes? Now let's see if I can make it. I mean, I was able to do it. No problem. A few tries, but you'll see. Ha! Now we will get this one. Sure, the trick is there, but there's a little block that we cannot do anything about. We can jump it. So what we gotta do is take the long way through all this really long path, full of spikes, and then go back down and do the same. Let's see if we can make it on the first try. Ah, come on! Almost. Almost there on the first try. It took me around more. It took me more than 2,000 deaths the first time to burn all this stuff. And I still can make it on the first try. It's very hard to. Alright, let's concentrate a little. It's not hard because I know it. But still. Like one little mistake and I end up having to do it all over from the beginning. And the hardest part is passing the blue and the yellow part at the end. And going back to the green part. Once you're here, it's kind of easy because, yeah, there's a lot of space. I found it. I suggest you just say when you do that because, hey, hey that's pretty hard, huh? Hey, it's okay. Alright, let's move on with our story, or quest. <laughs> okay, I'm wrinkling time. Whoa! And that's with me! Okay. These are the levels we visited before, but we're now visiting them from another angle to respect them. Okay. I wonder if the generator we set up in the polar dimension is what's affecting our teleporters. No, it's probably just a glitch. Okay, now there's the busted room. There's only a little space where you can stand. Beast ditch. Ah. There we go. Rise for the Reckless, he has one of the most hardest trinkets ever. It's not it's harder. It's not harder than the one we took before. No, this one is easier, but still well, kinda of annoying. So what you gotta do is you gotta get through some rooms here. In the a deception. So you'd be like, hey! It's pretty easy, right? I can just go left and then up and avoid those two things. Yeah, but if you do that, you won't get a trinket. Why? Well I can show that to you. Suppose we take all the checkpoints, right? And shenanigan. Whoop. Price for the reckless. Now, how are you supposed to get it? You're like, what the hell's going on here? I don't get it, but now you get it. Because she does that platform. You need to teleport there. I mean, you need to go there. But you see, if you leave the room and go back, this block will actually be back and you can't really do that. So what the heck are you supposed to do? Well, what are you supposed to do? It's going all the way back. Thank you. It's going all the way back. Hit this checkpoint and now go up there. Or up there, I know. Up there. Without touching checkpoints, so I have to do this the hard way. Now this is pretty hard, I'm going. That's the only way I know how to do it. I still don't know how it works! Damn it. My bad. Okay, now from here on, it's not hard. Ah, come on. I entirely forgot how to do that room. For some unknown reason. And that's not that hard. The artist room is a deception room here. Okay, now remember. 
I think I thought I saw it. Come on. What's happening to me? I can't remember to do the easy run. I can't remember to do the hard one. Okay, now I remember. There we go. Now you flip. Now you flip. And you go. Okay, now this is pretty hard. I need to avoid the checkpoints as well. Nah, come on! All the way back there. Alright. Almost there, though. There we go, done. Once you get here, you can just die any way you want. You'll be back there at the checkpoint and you can use your platform to collect your drink head. Then you can just rush for a year, no need to use... Don't need to be so... Reckless anymore. Okay. And finally, run upside down. Ah, oh, Brilliant, you got off the ship alright too? It's good to see you alright, Professor. The ship okay? It's been badly damaged. The violence has been working on fixing it. You could really use your help. Ah, oh, of course. The background interference is mentioned prevented the ship from finding a teleported when we crashed. We will all be teleported to different locations. Er, that sounds about right. Let's get back to the ship then. After you, Captain. Let's get out of here. You rescued the crew member! She remain. Oh, this is interesting! Captain, have you been here before? What? Where are we? I suspect something deflected our teleporter transmission. This is somewhere new. Oh no! She tried to find a teleporter and get back to the ship. When you're standing on the floor, Vitellari will try to walk to you. Yeah, exactly. See, when I'm standing on the floor, you actually try to walk me. When I'm not standing on the floor, though... Ah, oh, come on, seriously. What the hell is happening? This is so easy, how did I miss it? Follow me. Right behind you, Captain. When you're not standing on the floor, Mr. Larry will stop and wait for you. See? As soon as I split, he'll try to follow me. You can't continue to the next room until the safety the cross. You have to. There are some levels here that do have like intermission levels. And just this mechanic of you have to manipulate him with his movement. Very good! What, what do you make of all this, Professor? I'm guessing this dimension has something to do with the interference that caused us to crash. Maybe we'll find the cause of it here? Oh wow, really? Well, it's just a guess. I'll need to get back to the ship before I can do any real tests. Sure. Everything for you. It's pretty easy. He's gotta flip up quickly so that he doesn't run into trouble. And then just manipulate him. Now stay close to me. Oh, what was that? What was that? One? That big C thing. I wonder what he does. Uh, I don't really know how to answer that question. It's probably best to acknowledge that it's there at all. Then we should take it back to the ship to study it. We really shouldn't think about it too much. So let's keep moving. All right. Not too close. This is where it gets interesting. You gotta have him, you gotta have him mount on that platform. Stop him and then you can walk. Don't be afraid. Okay, wait a minute, wait a minute. Now here you gotta walk quick, very slowly. So he barely pulls up the platform. There we go. So as they say, you know, there's something really odd about this dimension. Yeah? We shouldn't really be able to move between dimensions with a regular teleporter. Maybe this isn't a proper dimension at all? Maybe some sort of polar dimension? Something artificially created for some reason? Can't wait to get back to the ship, I have a lot of tests run. Not as I do, this is actually pretty complex, and I couldn't get it the first time around I played this game, so... You gotta do here. Look down here. Keep leaving from platform to platform. Then you'll have him? Do the same, but it will leap from above the platforms. Like that. Okay. 
then it's just neat. Then you have to do the same from below again. And then from above. There you go. And your head. I wonder if there's anything else in this dimension worth exploring. Maybe. But we should probably just focus on finding the rest of the crew for now. Yeah, no, this one. Ouch. This one! I don't really know how to do it. I mean, this is what I do. I stand here on the. between the spikes. Then I stand here between the spikes and then I don't have. I have no idea. What the hell? Okay, I did it. Don't tell me how I did it. Because sometimes it. Sometimes the Tillari just keep crashing on the spikes for no no reason. And he just can't run a lot fast enough. You fall behind the speed. Pretty easy actually. You gotta manipulate him to fall down the edge. Like that. That's the mist! At last, let's go back to the ship. There we are. And there's Vitalari. Hi there. I think it's no coincidence that the teleporter was drawn to that dimension. There's something there. I think it might be causing the interference that's stopping us from leaving. Sure. But let's find somebody else. So, there was something. That green section over there. But to get there. Okay, I'm gonna go bob the ship. Then this way. I don't quite remember where it is, but there is a kind of secret passage around here. Now this leads to a trinket, so you know what? Since we're here, we might as well take it. There it is. Thirteen out of twenty. Okay. All right. Ah, oh, come on! I was almost there. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Boom. I think I found it. Is this, is this it? No. It's real close though. And there is... Shrink it nearby as well. Might as well take it. Yeah, it's this way. Okay, come on. There it is, found it. 14 out of 20. Eventually, if you collect if you collect a lot of them, like I think 15, you'll be able to talk to Violet and she will tell you Violet will for you. And she will tell you the location of the remaining ones. We'll mark you on the map. Just a small modification to the usual parameters, you are able to stabilize an infinite tunnel. Okay, that's the end for our last area. We'll go there last. Okay, got a teleport so I can go back here anytime I want. Now what I need to do... Yeah, I need to go left from here. Whoop! No. So what I gotta do... And go on because this, is, this part has always been kind of cryptic to me. Yes! Yes, there we go. This is the passage that took me forever to find on, a, on my first try of the game. Okay, teleporters. Okay, this way. Double up. Downstairs, upstairs. Going to the teleporters. Okay. Now there's a whole bunch of screens here that I need to explore them all. And the reason why is that at the end of the video I want to have a full map of this. So I need to explore all of these screens. They look the same, but one of them is actually a trinket. That's 15 out of 20. So we're only missing five of them. Up. We go with these screens. So you see we're down. We're down there now. And 
standard. And then these, this one here. Up here, there's more. Okay, that's the beginning. So, okay, you can go this way, right? No, it's blocked. So, you need to go down here. It's blocked. This is a. Okay. We found everything here. So now let's move to the third area. Four, third. One. Well, to the next area. To the second to last area, actually. Alright, let's do this. This is how it is. So, yeah, the mechanic here is that when you reach the end of. The end of all the screen, you'll look back to the other side. Uh, come on. There you go. Uh, you need the checkpoint if you like. There we go. Alright. Four little D guys. As you like it. Ah, come on. The beginning is pretty easy, but later on this... It really becomes pretty hard. There's a certain of here that's actually kind of hard. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Time to get serious. Alright. Village Wormhole. Alright, I don't really know how to do this, I just go around and Ouch. Ah, come on! How could it be so stupid? It was really hard, easy to avoid there. Okay, hang on. Ah, it gets me there. Okay, I got it. Not here, though. There we go. That, it wasn't that hard. Whoop! The other day I was chased down a hallway by a giant queue with the word AVOID on it. These security measures go too far. Indeed they do. Come on. Isn't too bad. Just remember that you move faster than those things, so... Find the gap. Okay. Oh, 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 did it. Oh, here where the trigger is. Add games. This place, this place sucks. I'm telling you. The only way into my private lab anymore is by teleporter. I made sure that it's difficult for unauthorized personnel to gain access. Now it's difficult to explain how to get there actually. But I'll just do it and you'll see. Uh, it's pretty hard. Come on. It'll take me a while. Did it! Haha! This copy what it did because seriously, it's hard to even explain in words. For me at least. Okay, to the butt cave! Whoop! There we go! Uh, wait a minute. Uh, this. Whoop! Whoop! There we go. These little passages. Okay, from here on, start the difficult point. Next one, especially. It's really hard. Waiting for the right time here. Now. Okay, now. The last one! Haha! This is hard, that's why I have to kill you. Okay, the first art is not that bad. Boom. And then you have to mine a lot of things. Oh! Come on! Over there. Because you have to watch the heart, the two hearts that go up and down and the two that go horizontally. That's pretty really confusing sometimes. sometimes. There we go. Whew. Not easy being green. Hi there. Captain, I'm being so worried. See a Fertigris. We are okay. I've been trying to get out, but I keep going around in circles. I come to back I'm come from the ship. I'm here to teleport you back to it. Is everyone else alright? It's Violet. She's fine. She's back on the ship. Oh great, let's get going then. Sure, green dudes can flip. For some unknown reason. Why drink Dreammaker? Hey you. 
Can you please? Like, you don't need to have him come over here, but I'm sorry. But... Can you even make it there? Okay. Hi. Right, finally, let's get out of here. You don't need to have him walk there. I just wanted to do that for some unknown reason. It probably looks better. Yeah, rescue the crew member. What remains? Uh oh, not again. Vertigris, where are you? Ah! Hang on, I'll save you. Sure, we down the shaft. We sports. Okay, let's do this. This is probably the area where I'll die the most. Survive for 60 seconds. You don't really need to do that. I mean, you do need to do that. Every 5 seconds, you get a checkpoint here. If that's any of those, you die. Every five seconds you get a checkpoint, so yeah, don't worry, you will make it on the first try. I'm gonna die a lot here, unless I'm really lucky and skill which I I'm not That's pretty good though. Ah there you go. First death. This will probably be the room where I'll die the most. The game will tell you at the end of the game in which room which room I died in I in which room I died the most, and this will probably be it. Probably. Get harder and harder as it progresses. It's really hard to keep up sometimes. Ugh, this part sucks, I hate it. Uh, 30 second part, I hate this part. I don't know how it works. I'm gonna die a lot here. Like a lot. Just 50 seconds. Just. Come on. 5 seconds. Let's get to 25. What the hell? I already got how this part works. Okay, got it. Whatever. No. Again. 20 seconds, I'm fine. Next part. Way easier. Ah. Come on. No hard. Ah, 15 seconds. Oh, that was a dodge. Three, two, one. Come on! What was like two seconds away? No, less than two seconds. There we go. Count of third. Phew, you're okay. I feel dizzy. Indeed. I feel dizzy as well. Let's get out of here. Okay. Now let's talk to Bird the Gris. I think it's not over here. Fly on the two box area. The order dimension we ended up in must be related to this one somehow. Indeed. Now what I wanted to do is speak to Victoria. Captain, come have a look at what I've been working on. It looks like these shiny things are giving off a strange energy region. Re so I analyzed it. And I was able to find more of them with the ship's scanner. Yeah, we're missing three more to be exact. And there they are. If you get a chance, it might be worth finding the rest of them. Don't put yourself in any danger, though. Don't worry, just don't worry. No, let me think about it. Um, stats. We got 16, right? Yeah. We got 16, the map is showing me. Three of them. They makes 19, and the last one is found at the very end, so it's not on them. All right, I know what I gotta do. I think. <laughs> okay, before we get to the last area, I'm gonna explore the whole map. It's actually gonna take a while, but it'll be worth it. Okay, down, down there. Now we haven't seen that 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 square down there. Hang on. Got it now. Okay. What we haven't seen? All that part there? Uh, the part over here. Okay, now we're there. Let's go straight down. We'll clear all that. Oh 
Okay. This is the portal. So this guy got to the left. Okay, there is something here. To believe is a it's a yeah, it's a teleporter. I've had to seal off access to most of our search. Who knows what could happen if it fell into the wrong hand. This is not an area, this is a bonus area. We'll get into that one. No. I still have a lot to explore here, so I'll stay. I'll stay. Okay. Alright, go down here and clear that. Okay. Now, I'll just go straight up from here. Clear all these rooms. Okay. Despite our best efforts, the dimensional stabilizer won't hold out forever. Hold forever. Its collapse is inevitable. Huh? These coordinates aren't even in this dimension. Now, I don't know why he says that. Like he's supposed to, he's supposed to uh, indicate a place or something. Well, it doesn't. It doesn't point you to anything. Because you know, if you find one of the terminals that that points you to places that you haven't that you have already been to, Viridian here will say, "Oh, I already found this." It's similar to that. So I don't know. Okay. So here's another string cat. Let's see. See. It's a pretty long path here. And there's an easter egg over here. There's just this shiny elephant. That for some reason if you stay long enough in this room, Viridian will become sad. This is an easter egg of the developers. I really know a lot about it. 17 out of 20. Two more trinkets, I mean three more. Two in the last two in the final in the last area. The red area. Where we'll find Vermilion. And then one. Right at the very end, so... Okay, let's go down. Whee! Right, let me see here. Let's get back to the teleport. I need to go to the, to the left of the map. Give me a teleport! Please! Where's the teleport in the middle of nowhere here? There it is. Okay. Okay, so the, the right ear of the map is all is all done. Just need to do the, the other part. Shit. Boom. Okay, I need to walk all the way there, all the way to the right. Until are we going this way? No, we didn't. Okay. Until we find the pit. Okay, this is the pit. This pit will look back to the, up to the about part of the screen. Should look about. Okay, it does. I'm falling down. And I believe this is the entrance of the area. Yeah, this is the entrance of the area. Well, first I need to explore everything, so... Let me just... Give me just a second and I'll finish exploring. Up there, walk all the way here. Checkpoint in case you die. Okay, we haven't done this part. No, we haven't. Okay. Right up, 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 up. Okay, I think that's it, right? Yeah. The other parts will be explored later, so. Now hold the right part to the right, so go up here. Look at these rocks. Okay, now let's go down from up here, of course. Okay, now I just need to go uh, right once and then go up here. Clear all those rooms. Okay, now there's all the bottom part. Okay. 
Whoop. This whole part here, and the part next to it. Teleporter nearby. Should be here. Yeah, it's up there. Come on. There it is. Our first breakthrough was the creation of the inversion plane, which creates a mirror dimension beyond that given event horizon. Yeah, look, you see, we already found this. See, oh, we already found this. This is the first area with the flipping, with the white flipping lines. Okay. That's it. That's it. We found everything. It's almost a full map. We just need to get to the last area. So we'll just go through the Pit of Doom again. And fall straight down. Yeah. Fall, fall, down, down, down. No, there's actually ah that area. We haven't gone there. Sorry, I'm going. Just give me a sec. Okay, this little area was all we were missing. Yeah. Okay, let's take the teleporter. Add it to the final area. Teleport Diver. D Tower! Well, the mechanic here is this area is moving up. Move fast, up too fast, and you'll find spikes. Don't move up too fast, you'll find spikes. So you have to keep moving up. Okay, for the first trinket here, it's kind of complex what you gotta do. Ah, come on. Whoop, whoop, found it. That was easy. And the next one we already know. No, oh, come on, come on, come on, come on. Gee. All the way back there. Whatever the trick is, taken. So I'm fine. See, there are spikes up here. Now the second trick it sucks. You have to do this. Ugh. Ah, come on over there. Ugh. It's not pretty complicated, guys. No. Okay, now let's try not to mess this up. Whoa! Found it. Whoop, checkpoint. Now I'm good. I'm just missing the final trinket. Am I? Yes, I am. Good. Whoop, thank you, Aro, for pointing me to the right direction. Done. Seeing red. Captain, am I ever glad to see you? I thought I was the only one to escape the ship. But really, I knew it would be okay. So what's the situation? I see. Well, we'd better get back then. So teleport in the next room. You're asking the crew member. Oh, crew member rescue.
Welcome back! Hmm, where's Captain Meridian? Hello? Is anyone there? Temporary thought. Do not adjust the beyond. Regular service will return shortly. Okay. Well, this is the final level, so that's the final challenge. If you complete this, you complete the game. And there's a trinket at the end. Of it. Try giggling the antenna. Is it giggling or is it jiggling? It's probably jiggling. Please enjoy these repeats. Whoop. Whoop. 1954 World Cup. The Beast Togus. Stugus. The Beast Togus. I don't know what that is. I make some references now. The Untouchables. Uh, that I know it, but. Can I just not die, please? Then. On the waterfront. I don't even know this one. This one's pretty cryptic, but what you gotta do is this. Okay, Gans Mode. Now, here, don't be stupid and take this road. Dawn, just go over here, you'll avoid completely these circles. And what I gotta do here is this. Whoop! And now this is pretty complex. That's any of those moving things that you've done. Gotta do. Ah, come on over here. There we go. Your window. Oh. Ah, come on, it's so easy. There we go. 1950 the Silverstone Grand B. I don't even know what that is. Come on, how am I dying so much? Okay, die be repaired. Dimensional stability generator. Currently, st gener currently generating maximum stability. Status online, ready. Aha! This must be what's causing their time for us. I wonder if I can turn it off. Warning, disabling the dimensional stability generation might lead to instability. Are you sure you want to do this? Yes. Seriously, the whole dimension could collapse. Just think about this for a minute. Are you really sure you want to do this? Yes. Warning, dimensional stabilizer offline. Uh oh. It told you like a bunch of times not to do that and yet you press it. Hang on, can I go back? Okay. Upstairs, downstairs. Ah, I don't remember to do this, seriously. I just go randomly here. Oh, I did it! Oh. Five steps. This is the same as before. Exact. With the only problem is that they're closer now. Yes, I did it. Okay. Whoop. Whoop. Come on. Hup. 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 Okay, did it. Dial M for murder. Easy peasy. Okay, that was creepers. Did it. The Billy people. The Billy people. I mean, they are the Billy people. The Iridian and the others are the Billy people. I think. Pretty sure. Okay. Oh, panic run. And what you gotta do here is to drop here, flip there, and then drop here. It's kinda weird the first time you just pull it. In the margins. We've been here before. Ah, that's gay. Come on, it's almost over. Ah. Oh. Mild challenge. It's not that hard. Uh, okay, well. It's up there. Okay, did it in the margins. Come on! There we go. Whoop! The last throw. Gotta go, gotta go fast here. Boom! Found the shiny trinket. 20 out of 20. B! 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 B!
Yeah, let's see how that did that. Oh, crew members rescued. Drink it count 20. Game time 58 and 42. Total flips 1741. Total left 93. And on the 100 mark. Good. I just showed 14 deaths to grab it. Wasn't bad. I actually did less than 100 deaths. It was my goal. Any moment now. Hello, C -c -c Captain. You're all right. I knew it'd be okay. We were very worried when you didn't come back, but when you turned off the source of the ref interference, we were able to find you with the ship scanners and teleport you back on board. That was lucky. Thanks, guys. It looks like this dimension is starting to destabilize, just like our own. I'm sorry about that. Eventually, it collapsed completely. There's no telling exactly how long we are here. So, but the ship's fixed, so. As soon as we're ready, we can go home. What now, Captain? Let's find a way to save this dimension. And a way to save our home dimension, too. The answer is out there somewhere. Let's go. BBBBBB, starring Captain Brigham, Dr. Violet, Professor Vitellari, Officer Vermillion, Chief Vergegris, and Do Dr. Victoria. Created by Terry, Terry Kavanagh, for, I'm not pronouncing that right. Music by. Um, I'm not pronouncing those. Some of those are pretty hard, actually. By the way, the main guy who produced, produced this, the same guy who pro in, also made Super Accident, which is also pretty famous. Famous. Blah blah blah, can I skip through this? Yeah, okay. Well, the J name's there. Thanks for playing! Indeed. And then we get a nice picture with all the characters here playing. playing the drum, the guitar, and then lots of stuff. Congratulations, your save files have been updated. If you want to continue, you can explore in the game, select continue from the play menu. Reduction time trials, blah blah blah. Okay, if you continue, you'll be back at the ship. Now what you can do, since you have all 20 trinkets, and... Sorry about that. And a full map. Is go to the light blue area that you have, we haven't done yet. Let's talk to Vermilion first though. I mean, this mission is pretty exciting, isn't it? I wonder what we'll find. Now you can also find him outside of the ship. It's not... You cannot also always find him, but sometimes... He'll be... Around... Around here. Sometimes he'll be here. I just know. No, wait. No, he's not here. Where is it then? Uh, wait a minute. Wait just a freaking minute. No, he's like up. He's like up here. Please. Sometimes you can find him around here. You can find him here sometimes. It's not always here. I don't know what what makes him go over here or not. It's probably just random, but maybe there's something. Or maybe if you haven't done, since it's near the entrance of uh, the um, the warp level. Probably if you haven't done that yet. I'm, I don't know for sure. Anyway, with all tiny trinkets in our hand, we can go talk to Victoria. Wow, you found all of them! Really great! We run some tests and see what I can, if, I, if I can work out what they're for. That, that didn't sound good. Run! Oh no! Not again! Wait, it stopped. This is where this is where we were storing those shiny things. What happened? We were just playing with them and they suddenly exploded. Well look what, what they made. Is that a teleporter? I think so, but I never seen a teleporter like that before. We should investigate. What do you think, Captain? Should we find out where it leads? Let's go.
Oh no, we're trapped! Oh dear. Hmm, how should we get out of this? Combine! Or, you know, you could just have warp deck to the ship. Wow, what is this? It looks like another laboratory. Let's have a look around. Congratulations, you found a secret lab. The secret lab is separate from the rest of the game. You can now come back here anytime by selecting the new secret lab option in the play menu. We're still in the dimension BBB, by the way. So there's nothing here. What, what the secret lab already is really is for is mainly for achievements and stuff like that. I wonder why they abandoned this dimension. They were so close to working out to fix it. Maybe they can fix it. Maybe we can fix it for them. Maybe they will come back. This lab is amazing. The scientists who work here know a lot more about warp technology than we do. And down here there's Vermilion. Look what I found. It's pretty hard. They can only last for about 10 seconds. Warning, the Super Gravitron is intended for the entertainment, entertainment purposes only. Anyone found using the Super Gravitron for the educational purposes might be asked to stand the Nothing Corner, which is over here, and if you do that, Viridian will become sad. And then if you leave, you'll be happy again. Look the Super Gravitron, is like... Yeah, there's even a best time there. Which is my best time. It's like the Graviton is like a lot harder now, look at this shit. Whoa! Crap, I can't do it. Yes, return, thank you. Alright. Up here! There's more stuff. Captain, have you seen this? With their research in ours, we should be able to stabilize our own dimension. We're safe! Sure! Violet! Look at all this research! This is going to be a big help back home! And over here does the achievement run. We completed the game, we, went, we won the less than 500 deaths, and with less than 100 deaths. With less than 50 deaths, that would be a challenge for me. I just need to win, though, no need to get all the trinkets, so that's pretty awesome. Last one minute on the super gravity, on how bad you could do that. It's, it's pretty hard. Space Station 1 Master, yeah, you, 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 there are time trials that you can do and try to obtain maximum rank. And then over here, there's the, the final achievement. Complete the game in no death mode. You don't have to die for the whole game, which is... It's pretty hard. Anyway, that's it. That's all we have to do. The map is complete, I think. Ah, oh, no, there's two little squares we haven't, we haven't found. Ah, oh, I'm done. You know what? Pick the menu. I said I had to complete the map, and I'm gonna do that. Alright, that's the teleporter. Okay. I told you I wanted to have a complete full map 100%. I didn't see there were two squares that we had explored, so... Okay, one's down. The other one's there. It's this stupid elephant room. So I'm gonna have to go to the elephant room again. Okay, now I did it. Now I did it, right? Yep, I did it. 100%. So, that was B B B B B B, And that's it. 10 side base, but there's nothing else to do. That's, that was the game. That was B B B B B. So I'm just gonna see you guys in the next video. Bye bye.